cuffs on my wrist Cause I don't got the time to get in line yeah. What the fuck is up YouTube Big Deadly Kicks and Kickflips in the building Today I'm a little bit excited I get to see something that I thought I'd never see Not anytime soon at least But we get to see it today it's better come on when I walk up in this bitch. Mm -hmm. You notice how it didn't come on when I came in, right? Yeah, nigga, yeah, exactly. But when Kenny walks in. Yo. Fucking Kenny walks in. Different story. Different stories that a nigga can't write. Huh? Fuck your little Everything just bounces off. It's crazy. It's like. It's 100 pounds. I see the shadows in my room. So today we decided to bring the camera to the gym. We just came here to work out initially, but guess what? Your hands up. We happened to find somebody that was willing to spar with Eli in the gym. So this would be his first sparring session. I've been training him for about two months. It's been fucking horrendous. But now we're on to other videos. He's finally getting better. So you'll see that in the future, finally. So also keep in mind, this sparring session is strictly body shots. We didn't know the guy. We didn't want to go too hard. And also with Eli just learning, we only did two one minute rounds. I want you to watch the video. The guy apparently doesn't have any kind of training. He said he strictly does boxing for cardio for a workout. He has no training. And from what I've seen, it looks like He's pretty good for having no training at all. So with no further ado, we'll get to the video. I don't want to talk through the video. And at the end of the video, I want you guys to tell me who do you think won the match between these two guys and what can Eli do to improve? There's a lot to do in this and I want him to get better. Start. Okay, that's round one. And just so you guys know, this is a private gym on site in the complex. This isn't a public gym. This is one thing about Eli that annoys the shit out of me. I hate when he does his pushing shit. I think he did it one other time in the fight. 
I'm not really sure, but he gets a bit too close. You don't want to get too close to your opponent for somebody that can just grab you in the streets. That's one thing that he has to get rid of. Fifteen seconds. Time. Good shit, guys. <laughs> so, who do you think won this fight between Effie and Eli? What does Eli need to do to become a better boxer all around? What mistakes did he make in this fight? Please leave that information in the comments. If I could have made this video better, please tell me what I could have done better. And do not forget to subscribe. I have way more shit for you guys. I will be coming up with a series called Kenny Teaching Eli How to Box or something to that effect. So make sure to catch that series. And if you liked any part of this video, please share this with somebody. Let them know. Kenny and Eli is out here in these streets trying to fuck me big it up. Let's go. Okay. 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 Show the chain. Show that chain. Let me see. Let me see that bling bling. Oh. Get the acoustic in here. <laughs> Nigga came with the chain. The bada chain boom, bang. bada bang. Niggas don't know this shit ain't a fucking game. Until he just starts doing the bar on me. <laughs> <laughs>